moving far. Hello and welcome back to YFS TV. Today we are previewing the Charles Kelvin Cup final. Uh, we've got Kelso FC v Crand FC. Um, it sure to be a great game. Let's start with you, Andy. Um, how has your season been so far with Kelso? Yeah, the season's been good. It's kind of been stop and start, just due to all the obviously all the the the, the, the COVID implications. But um, we've had a, a good strong hold in the league. So we've uh, won a lot of games. We've been beat twice and uh, had a couple of good uh, cup runs. Uh, won our last cup final against Starnstone Rangers there last weekend. So yeah, it's been a pretty good season. The boys have been really good and working well together. So can't complain. It's been good. Sure. Well, I think you just answered my next question. Was there any personal highlights from the season so far? I know it's been very stop start, but I'll um, imagine it's been the cup final. Yeah, the cup final was really good. It was a uh, it was a tough, tough game in tough conditions as well. The heat's been uh, <laughs> swelling to say the least. But um, mm. yeah, we've had a few good highlights, uh, a few amazing team performances, um, controlling games from the start to finish. And um, but yeah, kind of. Semi-finals, nicking the last-minute goal, the winning on penalties. Um, that was a, a nail-biting moment, which was something we never really used to before. So it was, it, it was good. A bit of excitement there. So, how long have you been a coach, and how long have you been coaching Kelso this team? I've been a coach for about eight, nine years, eight or nine years now, um, and I've coached these boys, um, Danny, since he was five, six year old. Some of the boys have still got playing now since they were four year old. So. It's um, it's been a good, good, um, long time and been good development for the boys. It's been amazing to watch them grow up into little men. That's great. Let's move on to the council player, Danny. Uh, tell us a bit about yourself. Where do you play? Uh, I play in centre midfield. Sure. Um, how long have you been playing? Uh, since about six, seven years old, about that. So, a wee while. Where do you play in centre mid? Are you uh, attacker? Do you go get? Do you get some goals? Or do you sit in front of the defence and? Uh, be disciplined. A bit, a bit of both. I'd say a bit of both. That's great. Is this is this an achievement for you to reach a cup final? Have you reached finals before? Uh, we've reached them before, but still go down as an achievement. I'd say. And how have you found the season personally? Uh, I'd say it's been quite a good season for us as a team. And from this cup here, what's been your personal highlight of this? I know you, I know you just won that the other cup, but the Charles Kilwin Cup. What's been your highlight? Uh, probably the semi-final, scoring in the last minute, to equalise and end winning on penalties. That's great. Um, how is the feeling in the squad ahead of the final? Are you confident? Are you excited? Or just uh, go gang after the last one? Uh, yeah, excited. Looking forward to it. So let's move on to Cram and Lee. How long have you been involved in the club? Um, similar to Andy. I think I've been there a lot of the kids since they were about six seven year old so you know we've got kids you know 14 15 so right from you know four aside right through to seven aside nine aside so that's a good few in the club that have been there throughout the whole journey as well so yeah probably about eight years now or so is this your first final of the team or have you reached multiple before it is our first final yeah certainly at 11 aside so i'm um, looking forward to it so is this an achievement in reaching the final for your club? Are you looking to go on and win it, or is this the highest you've been as as part of the club? I think it's like any team. I suppose that get to a final. You know, once you're at that stage, the expectation, I suppose, is to to go on and try and get a result and you know get the victory. So yeah, I think you know, as I say, it's um you know main thing was getting through that semi final and getting to the final stage. But yeah, looking forward to it, confident, and hopefully it should be a good game. Yeah, you mentioned the semi-final then. Was, is that your? Is that the highlight of your cup run? Talk us through it. Yes, uh, definitely a cup run. Anyway, um, I mean, we we played Spartans in the semi-final um, two 0 and I think similar to what you mentioned, Andy, it was another one of those days. It was a really hot day, but yeah. um, it was a kind of dogged match. But I think we we played Spartans in the league earlier in the season and won, and um, got another good result against them in the cup. So it finished two 0 but. It was probably one of the highlights of the season for us in terms of the, the performance. You know, there were kids were one hundred and ten percent that day in terms of attitude, looked good defensively, and got a good result. It was nice to get a clean sheet, which you know Ben being a defender here, I'm sure he was happy about as well. Have, have you two uh, played each other this season? Lee? We've not. No, I mean it's interesting. You know, as Andy was mentioning there, um, we've played each because it's 
the COVID and things like that, where it's a reduced yeah. league fixture. Um, but um, Kelso are the only team that we haven't actually played in the league this season. So um, seen them, you know, and obviously seen the results and things. I know they'll be a good side, but yeah, it's the, it's the one team we haven't actually played this season in the league. Yeah, I'll make, I'll make for an interesting game. Um, yeah, definitely. So are you confident for the game on Sunday? I think so. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, and I know what the kids can do as long as you know we give one hundred and ten percent and we're kind of switched on from that first whistle. Um, yeah, confident. You know, it's again expected to be a good game. You know, by all accounts, you know, Kelso are a good side as well. I think they're probably goals, so it should be from a, a neutral's perspective an interesting match as well. But yeah, no, good preparation. Had a good week. Training was good earlier in the week, so confident and looking forward to it. That's good. Let's move on to you, Ben. Uh, Lee mentioned there you're a defender. Where about in defence do you play? Uh, I play centre back. Sure. How long have you been playing for uh, for um, Cramond? Uh, it must be about five or six years now. So yeah, a wee bit. Right. So you've been at Cramond all your life then. Yeah. And what would be uh, your personal highlight of the cup run? Do you have one? Uh, it was probably the same as Lee, the 2 0 win against Spartans just not too long ago. Uh, I thought we all played really well as a team together. Yeah, and with everyone, like everyone all across Scotland, the season's been stop start quite often. Uh, what's been your, how have you found it, and are you just happy to be back playing? Yeah, I'm definitely happy to be back. It hasn't been easy uh, stopping and starting, uh, not at all, really. But we kind of had to make do with the circumstances, just like every other club, really. Yeah, you don't know, you don't know when your next game's going to be, but um, yeah, you're looking forward to the, the final on Sunday. Yeah, I'm absolutely buzzing for it. It's going to be a good game. And how's the feeling in the squad? Are you confident or are you excited? And yeah, I say the team's very excited. We can't wait to play. Yeah, we're really eager to play. That's great. Just finally, guys, I'd like to get your score predictions. Let's go back to where we started with Andy. What's your score prediction for the game? Um, I think it's it's, it's going to be an NTN game. Both teams um, are probably going to be up for it. The cup finals, whoever wants it, the day's going to take it. Um, but the way our boys are playing, I think Kelso will probably take it. In my eyes, obviously biased, but I think it could be maybe 3-1, 3-2. Sure, let's move, to, let's move on to you, Danny. Uh... I'll go positive. I'll say three two Kelso. I think it'll be a close game, but good. What about you, Lee? Switch I think I'll echo some of the points Andy mentioned, apart from the scoreline. I think it will be a, a a good game. I think it'll be you know two teams eager to play football, and it should be um, end to end. I think there'll be goals in it, but I fancy probably three two or four two to Cramond. And what about you, Ben? Finally, yeah, I think it'll be a close game, probably two one Cramond. Right, so you've all gone for high score, high scoring uh, scores there. I'm not sure how Ben would find that as a defender, but um, look, it's certainly a game to look out for this weekend at uh, Bongi Rig on Sunday in the cup final between Kelso and Cramond. Uh, thanks for your time, guys. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.